What is up lads and welcome to the first episode of my dream team journey. So this is going to be a mix between a Twitch stream and a YouTube series. Uh, we're doing a YouTube video today. It's going to be a long episode hopefully where we kind of set up our team, uh, open some uh, of the players that we've built up through the veterans bonus and from playing eFootball 0.9 and then just do a test on everything. So I know my lighting is still a little bit off. Uh, the camera is still a little bit glitchy. I don't know there's some kind of issue with the USB port I think. But hopefully the mic is good, the sound quality is good, the video feed is good from the PS5, and we can crack on once this is good. So hopefully you see this like in its in its full episode. I'll cut out a couple of the boring bits um, because we have to set up our team and name our team and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, right. So we're going to have that in. Just get that out of the way. Just name your team. And then obviously you're going to have the jerseys and all that. No edit mode yet, unfortunately. So no custom kits and stuff like that. But I, I think it will come soon. So yeah, here we go, lads. This is it. So this is going to be our login bonus. Obviously, you've seen probably all the guys streaming. Um, and, you know, that will continue to stream this game starting their, their journey from scratch. Um, so... Yeah, you probably have already seen all this, so you can skip ahead if you want. But this is just a login bonus for anyone new that's watching this that has missed a couple of streams or whatever. You get a login bonus every day. It's laid out here what you actually get. So it's pretty decent. You can kind of build your team. And then there's obviously like a startup season one login bonus as well, which is just GP. So combining the two of these, you're going to have a lot of stuff. If you've played V0.9 and you've been, you know, sweating it out, playing um, V0.9 when it first launched back a couple of months ago, you're going to have a load of stuff, right? You're going to have a load of GP and a load of rewards that you earned through them campaigns. Um, if you've played a lot of PES 2021 as well, yeah, or PES 2020, the season update, the last game, the last PES title, you're going to have a veterans bonus as well that carries over from them. So the more legend players and iconic players that you had in that PES squad in my club, you're going to get uh, bonus players here. So I've got two veteran bonus iconic moment players. And I've also got one pot. Woo! Baby! Monty Burns style. 1.1 million of GP added to my... Oh man, I'm getting loads of stuff here. 600 eFootball Plus member VIP. Uh, 4,000 training program by 46. That's a PlayStation Plus member bonus. Anyone can download that PlayStation Plus uh, bonus as well. Just go on to the... PSN store. Uh, I'm not too sure. I think it's just for PlayStation users. Go onto the PSN store and search for eFootball and it should pop up. It's free to download. 50,000 apology from admin. Thank you. Accept that. And then there's a couple of issues here. Screen stuttering on the PS4 and Xbox One. I haven't. I'm obviously playing on PS5, so let me know if that's been an issue for you guys in the, in the chat below. But look, they seem to be aware of it. Now, agents, iconic players, featured players, legend players, all that sort of stuff is coming the 21st. So next Thursday, um, I know that they've added a couple of bits and pieces here with the tours and stuff, which we'll get into. Um, but yeah, I mean, a lot of this UI isn't needed. Just let me in. So from here, we're going to collect our rewards. Um, and we've got 26 notifications here. So we've got 19 in the inbox. I'm going to mark all them as red, get them out because I just couldn't be dealing with that on my screen. Right, so here are my rewards. So I have got Chance Deal Veteran Bonus by 3, 45,000 GP here, uh, 3 a thousand training programs, another 7.5 grand GP, another training program, 125,000 GP. That was for season one of the campaign with 0 0.9. Startup login bonus of GP, a million for the veterans bonus GP, uh, two veteran bonus, iconic moment players, chance deals, apology, login bonus, login bonus, gift from admin, gift from admin. And then you have your PS uh, Plus member bonus as well, which you can see here, 300 coins, uh, all that sort of stuff. So the coins won't be like able to be used until I think next Thursday as well with that. So I'm going to receive all of them and then we're going to go ahead and go into we're just going to dive straight in so and go into the to the players here and and start building our squad and do a bit of a squad builder play a couple of games probably one or two offline and then we'll jump online as well so yeah let's see so from here i can get my special player list right so i've got five of these oh man this is this is crazy i've got five of these out of 11 players so let's see who i can actually get from here so I've got five chances of these. Oof. I mean, straight away there, lads, I want Roberto Carlos and Vieira. If I get two of them, I don't care who else I get. I know Beckenbauer is an absolute monster, um, like with the stats and stuff. And, you know, they're all B form. 
Uh, Becca Bar only goes six levels, so they have revamped the levels completely uh, to what they used to be. But yeah, I mean, I had Piaul, Beckenbauer, Can, Beckham, Forlan. I pretty much had every single player here last year on my club. Um, but I think Paddy V is the man that I want to see. Get. I'm going to chance deal here. So this is just bonus uh, for the veterans bonus that I have. Um, I love this new animation as well, to be fair. Let's see who we get. Paddy V off the rip. Come on, Paddy. Patrick Vieira. Come on now, baby. Let's go. Or else Carlos. I'd be happy with Carlos. So Paddy V, yeah, get in there, boy. That's what I'm talking about. What an absolute unit. Oof. He looks good, man. That high, high render looks really, really good. So Paddy V is going to be tearing it up in the central midfield for me, DMF. I mean, I'm sorted now till pretty much the end game. I'm going to be sorted with Paddy V. He's the ultimate DMF that you could get. Buzzing with that, boys. Buzzing with that, to be honest. So we'll go ahead and skip on that. So here he is, box to box. Um, I know that they're going to be releasing some special players, but I actually love this, right? I love this design. I know, look, the, the blue, poor. It's very poor. It like kind of hurts the eyes and it hurts your soul. But I think, it, you know, it, it will be improved. I think that that is something that they'll definitely, definitely look at, um, is that blue background. But yeah, I mean, Paddy V, I'm not going to get too hyped yet because I want to see who else I get. But that is, that is a monstrous pull from Paddy V there. Monsters pull from Paddy V is all, all you want. So I'm going to do another one of these. Will I do all of these, lads? I mean, this is why I want to be Twitch streaming live, because you guys would probably be hyped in the chat. Um, but let's see. I don't think I can get duplicates either, so I'm absolutely buzzing that I got Paddy V. I want Carlos, though. If Carlos, if Carlos comes up on the screen, the top is coming off. That's all. No, it's... Who is it? Inzaghi? Not bad. Not bad. We'll play Inzaghi as kind of like a target man and see how he goes. Maybe pair him with like a, a kind of a youthful pacey striker to see what Inzaghi can do I mean Inzaghi's going to be a bit slow I think I must say lads I do love the car design and the presentation it looks really NBA 2K-ish but yes. uh, I don't know do I want um, Romario in my squad because I have a plan for who I'm going to get with the GP but we'll take him if we get him I mean I'm going to have a stacked team this to me right the reason why I'm not as like you know super like oh, it is Romario what an absolute beast Look at this, lads. What a team I'm putting together here straight off the rip. War Mario looks unbelievable, man. Look at this. Absolute beast. The reason why I'm not getting, like, super, super hyped um, is because I, I'm more of a player that, like, I would prefer to grind. You know what I mean? And I'm not talking about on a pole or up against the wall. I'm talking about actually sitting down, chilling out with a squad and picking and choosing what players I want to actually have in my squad. And I think that this just takes... Look, I'm playing the game since last September, October, when they released V0.9. So it's not like everyone's going to have a day one team like this. But the fact that I'm going to have, you know, Patrick Vieira, who's my DMF for the rest of the series, or the rest of the game uh, this year, and I'm probably going to have Romario, who's going to be up there as my main striker now. Like, you know, and Zaggy's not going to really feature. But, like, if I get Carlos here or I get Beckenbauer, I kind of have, like, all my main players in their main like positions sorted you know what i mean so like i would have just liked more of a grind hopefully they have tournaments where it's just like limited or whatever Whoa, look at this syria look at this man this is really shiny it's four star it must be surely yeah it is i'm okay with that i mean he'll be somebody that i that i take a look at i know a few of the lads were saying that he's really good shooting ability so i haven't checked out his stats yet but i will check it out now AS Roma legend, of course, as well. And again, I do love that car design, man. I do love that car design. I want to have Pedri as my attacking midfielder, so I might have to pair Nakata back with Pedri, maybe have a two-man pronged attacking midfield. But uh, low pass 81 is pretty decent. Speed, balance, stamina. Yeah, not bad. I want bad. Carlos here, big time. He would be my main player to get. I'd be disappointed if I don't get a five-star, five-star. Yeah, let's go, baby. Let's go, Carlos. Nah, it's not Carlos, lads. It's Piaul. Okay, so we've got our center back. We have got our... We've got everyone, really. We've got our center back. We've got our... Um, who else have we got? Yeah, we've got our center back. We've got our DMF. We've got our AMF. We've got two strikers up front. Uh, so we can kind of focus now the squad on maybe getting a bit of pace in there. Maybe getting the goalkeeper as well, like having a proper goalkeeper in there. But yeah, I mean, Piao, oof, 90 pass, 90 tackle and 92 aggression. I like that. Only Roy Keane would have higher aggression than that. Duration of contract is 364 days. So 
I like the way that they've done this, right? So the type of the player, 2006, Spain 2006, and that they've really kind of looked at the levels and stuff as to why uh, certain players level the way they do, because you can customize the training now. So that is going to be very interesting. Uh, we hope you enjoy playing. Yes, I'm going to, hopefully. I mean, I have five stacked players now at the moment. So I have 1.6 million GP. I mean, I'm going to pretty much be able to buy whoever I want to buy now. Um, which again, you know, it's just, it's kind of, for me, like, look, you can look at it both ways, right? On one hand, I do love the fact that you can kind of buy and sell players and try players. And it's a, it's a, it's a massive, like I was overwhelmed with how deep this can actually go watching some of the streams last night. Um, but like, yeah, I mean, I could blow it all on Lewandowski or Salah or Messi or Mbappe or whoever. Um, but to be honest with you, like, I'm probably going to take a look at my team and get the boys in if I can. Now, I know I have to sign it to kick off. You do have to sign a player. So, I mean, first first things first, I probably do want to sign a goalkeeper um, and train him up because, like, I have Romario up front. Um, I have, like, I have an okay team at the moment. Obviously, I need to fill the rest of the positions, but I'm stacked in terms of legends. So, like, I'm not really going to complain about that. Uh, but... I'll probably try and get with somebody like mid range that will be upgradable, but isn't going to be my end game kind of guy because obviously you know it's going to be a long road to before I start getting players that I really want, um, you know, and that'll be me using them. So I probably want a bit of a bit of speed, but I think Pedri is the man that I probably would have gone for if I hadn't gotten got um, Nakata. But now I'm kind of thinking, okay, maybe I need somebody with a bit of pace. Vinicius will be decent, man, as a winger. I don't even know what formation I'm going to I'm gonna use, to be honest. Let me have a look at the Irish boys, right? It should be cheap as ships, but we'll have a look at the Irish boys here now and see what the story is, see how much they are to buy, because uh, I wouldn't mind a bit of Shamey, Shamey C, Shamey Coleman, you know, and see what he'd be like. So we've got Egan, Duffy, Doherty, Clark Coleman. I mean, they're very cheap, like, they're very cheap. I like the fact that Coleman can go up that level now. Let me have a look at this little guy, the little beast. Let me have a look at Coleman now. He looks good. He looks good. Hmm. He's got nice, nice ability, man. I mean, the, the question remains is like 10,000. 10, I've got 1.6 million. So it probably would be, it probably would be a bit kind of crazy to buy him. Like, I think I need to splash out on a goalkeeper, to be fair. I don't like that you have to go back into that. I like, you need to press triangle to go back into the filter and then reset it. Okay. Um, so let's see. Let's have a look at goalkeepers and see what the crack is with goalkeepers. Neuer is obviously the, the biggest. Oh, all black is obviously the most expensive. So I can sort by. I'll sort by what player value. Okay, that's obviously something to come in because it's not there yet. Sort by this. So, I mean, Donnarumma looks. Oh, he looks good. Summer. Do I want? Do I want a goalkeeper? That's kind of cheap and cheerful for now before I decide like who I'm going to buy and what, uh, like who fits in with my manager and stuff. Do I want Ute or do I want an absolute unit and spend half my coins or my GP? Like this on? is what I, like I love this. I would stay in this menu like looking at players, even though I can afford pretty much everybody. Um, I could stay looking at this and deciding who I want, you know, because it's not just about, like if you go into Cancelo here, it's not just about him as a player it's also about his team play style so like he's 71 possession game 75 counter and then 78 out wide so like i'm probably going to play out wide that's how i play most of the time i want two wingers um so i do kind of want like a defensive minded center back or a right back that's going to be able to get up and down the pitch without you know breaking the bank um I could go Dumfries. I could go Dumfries. He'd be quite good. But I mean, look at his team play style. Like, it's very poor. Uh, defensive engagement, 63. Defensive awareness. So let me have a look, right? So I'm going to go with... Do I want quick counter or possession game? I'm probably going to go out wide, to be fair, lads. Um, to see who's the best with that. Jesus, Navis is, looks like a good option there. He's cheap. Navis is cheap, but he's he's probably a bit small for right back. You know, because I have Piaul there. Do I want an end game? Do I want an end game right back? Let me see how much Basaka is actually. Basaka is probably not here. He's probably a different. Lads, Reese James is looking interesting here. I must say, 62 out wide. I can upgrade that. 
you know, he's tall, he's fast, he's strong. Defensive is 62. Mm, that should be a bit higher. I would like to see that a little bit higher now. What's this? 62 as well. Mm, this is tough, man. This is very, very tough. Oh, Maggio, I remember this guy. He was absolutely a unit, boy. He was. Nelson Semedo. Ricardo Pereira. What's his defensive? 62. Crap. Kyle Walker. Oh, my God. It's like a slight delay. I don't like that. Kyle Walker, 62. Aggression. Quadrado, 66. Hakimi, 63. So they're all very attacking. Yeah, I mean, this is this is tough, man. This is tough. I think, to be honest with you, lads, I'm going to go with... Who did I see here a second ago? Um, Reese James. I think I'm going to go with Reese James. He's a nice balance of youth. Uh, he's a nice balance between height, strength. He should be able to get up and down the pitch. And I'll be able to kind of... Oh, he's got long ball expert as well. The thing I like about him here is his defensive engagement and his aggression. So I'm going to sign him. Listen... I've got I've got 1.6 million and I'm 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 cribbing over a couple of hundred thousand if I was to to uh to spend it but I just want to get in and see my team first and set it up and not have to you know buy somebody like Reese James who doesn't fit into the playstyle of me playing out wide at least I know this guy is going to fit and it's not it's not going to be something that I spend 300,000 on like Cancelo so yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm happy enough with James doing yeah, that. I'm probably going to keep... Look, I'm obviously going to be keeping Pat Patrick Vieira as my end game guy. He's going to be my main uh, DMF for the foreseeable. So, man, I've got like so many XP. Let me see. That pushes it over the edge. Okay, so this is what you do with the training. So I see a lot of people doing this. You train up the player, and then once you've that done, you go back, and then you're able to actually like put the stats into wherever you want to put them, right? So you can either put them into play style proficiency. So if I want to, I can put 18 progression points here that I've built up from that. Oh, it upgrades it by 10. That's crazy, man. Yeah, I was thinking that it was a bit low there. So I can, I can make this i can make paddy v now go into an out wide so i'll probably need to put him at like 85 there i don't need 99 i don't think i can always do it again anyway so i'll put that in there and then i have 16 for his stats so this ranges from shooting passing dribbling all that sort of good stuff uh dexterity covers like a multitude of like they all cover a range of stats it's not just like one or two so it's broken into like seven or eight i obviously you know, it's cool that you can upgrade his, his goalkeeper awareness. I don't know why that would increase his jumping for strength. But yeah, I mean, if you want to increase the goalkeeper and put him in there, he's never going to get up because it is soft capped. But um, I do like the range in this. If I wanted to have, you know, Paddy V as an AMF, I could put him as an AMF and put his shooting up to 77. Um, you know, I could even go back and let's see if I wanted to take, let's see if I wanted to take this out, how good I could actually make him with uh shooting right so i could put his shooting up to 78 there um i could put his passing up to 90 low pass i mean i like that i really like that i must say but i am going to keep his proficiency for out wide look i'm going to put it at 75 for the time being because i'm not 100 percent sure if i'm going to play out wide yet it depends what what kind of manager i get but we will do that um I am probably going to max out his, let's see, so his acceleration and his defending. That's probably the two keys that he wants. Defending five, and then where's his speed? Do one and that, and there's his speed. So I'm going to go speed merchant style. I don't like the way that that mm, stamina is huge, though. Speed 78. Will I put one more into speed? 79. 90 stamina and put one maybe 79 balance offensive yeah i'm gonna put one into passing two into passing one in there and then i'm probably going to put one more into here oh no, i can't it's soft capped see i like the way it's kind of capped that you can have a player like over a certain limit you can have like 99 in the rating i like that i do i like that a lot so will we leave the passing or the, no, we don't need dribbling. I can't upgrade him any more than that. I can't upgrade him any more than that. Aerial strength, jumping and physical contact, header. 
No, to be honest with you, I'm probably going to put it into passing strictly because I do need to him him to be... No, do I though? Dribbling. Tight possession. Yeah, I'll probably put it into that. Right, so I'm going to use all them points. And then my Patrick Vieira becomes customized to how I want him to be. So he's 95 overall. And I'm going to lock him now. I'm not too sure I've made a contract. Oh, 60 days to renew it. Okay, we'll have a look at that later on when we need to do I, it. Like, I need speed. If I'm going to be playing Romario as my main striker and then get a, like a, a lump of a lad like maybe Haaland, who's like my physicality guy or my physical guy, um, I need I need like I need his pass his shooting to be this is a tough call, man. Because I need Okay, let me see. I'm gonna take one off from here. No, I'm gonna leave. Yeah, I'm gonna take Okay, it takes two points up. Oh, I like this. I like this a lot. I must I must say now, this is my first time really looking into it. Let's see what it takes to put up my speed a little to, to that. I think that's probably the better option there. 89 acceleration, uh 87. Do I do one more? Do I do one more shooting? 89. I think that's what I'm going to go with. 86 speed, 89 acceleration. I think that's probably the way to do it. I could take his... No, I'll leave that wide. I'll leave the out wide on. And this is obviously a mixture between the manager's rating. And it's also a mixture between the team that I have at the moment. So my team play style, if you go into Patrick Vieira here right and you go into his details you'll see here let me see let me see let me see so yeah so this team play style proficiency here out wide is 75 right but if i go into like say this guy because he's in my squad and i go into him and i go down to his it's going to be 60 so his average is going to obviously his rating is going to bring down the average of the team like which makes sense so the more i fill this with players that are able to play out wide and if i get a manager that has a higher out wide rating here. His is at 50. If I sign a manager, let's have a look at the managers actually. Let's have a look. So if I sign a manager, um, if I sign a manager that is, let me see, the managers are dear, man. I could whack the whole, the whole last here. Let's see. Right. So if I'm going to go for an out wide manager at the moment, right, let me see. I could go Kudorini. I mean, we need to get... Ooh, let's see what Southgate is like. Southgate doesn't look too bad, actually. We need the option files, man. We need the option files. So he's 76 out wide. On top of that, right, you also have the coach and affinity, which every manager has kind of a boost, like a manager boost. So Southgate's is match experience points gained by players under 24 is increased by 100%. So you're going to double the experience points. So if you've got a player that's 25 years old, and you get a thousand XP when you play a match, he'll get a thousand XP. If you get if you have a player in your team that's like 20 years of age, you will get that a thousand XP plus Southgate's a hundred percent bonus, which doubles it. So you'll get two thousand XP. So not only do you kind of like increase the play style that you have if you're playing out wide and up the rating, you also get more like coins and bonuses and stuff like that. So say like Pochettino. He has increased his experience points for five PV player gain during a match by 100%. He's another one that plays out wide. Rhea, he increases experience points midfield players gain during a match by 300%. I think I'm going to go with this manager because he's 77 out wide, so I can commit to that. We'll sign that manager, right? Now, I'm going to go back in here to my squad because I know, look, it is, it is kind of confusing in a way. But if I go back into my squad now and change manager, my play style should, uh, should increase. So my team, man, they need to work on speeding this up a little bit. It's, it's kind of sticky. A little tiny little second uh, delay. So if I change, so it's 63 there at the moment. If I change manager to this guy, confirm, it goes up to 71. The reason for that is because I'm playing a manager now that is linked up with the players out wide. And also because his, his, um, his tactics are better suited for out wide. So he's 77 out wide. Now, I wonder with my team play style, let me see, live update rating, team play style, basic, basic info. So here's the, here's the rating that they have with the team play style. So Vieira is 75 because I upgraded him. Romario 75, upgraded him. But Piaul is 55. So Piaul is going to bring that down. This guy's going to bring it down. This guy, Kirkik, 
Kirkic, he's going to bring it down 44. I mean, he's captain. I don't know what's going on with him. I think I'm going to go all in on a goalkeeper, right? And the reason why is I need the best possible goalkeeper. I don't want I don't want Neuer, though. I've had really bad experiences with Neuer. I can't remember. I think it was Cannes last year that I had. Um, I'm, I'm going to start this by... I'm going to start this by out wide to see who fits best with me and see, oh, Neuer, it'd have to be you. I'm not spending 500k on Neuer, though, because I, I know he's class, right? And I know he is going to be class, but he's just, his player ID, man, it doesn't suit me, like, on the counter and stuff. He'd just he'd be off his line the whole time. There's nothing worse than getting lobbed or getting a shot or feeling under pressure when he's coming out trying to play centre-back as a sweeper. Um, Jan Sommer, he might, be, he might be decent, actually. Let me see. Let me see what Jan looks like. Very good player as well. I like him. I can see I can boost him up. I'm not I'm not too worried about boosting the player up too much. And like, look, part of the journey is buying a player and him being shit and throwing him off into the curb, kicking him to the curb, you know? That's part of it as well. The other thing is I don't really want to. No, let me see. Let me see what I'm gonna do, right? I'm gonna filter this. And I'm gonna just do it by price. Because I can always change there. It's easy to change the play style. I think my budget for the goalkeeper should be probably maybe 250k. So I can probably get Ter Stegen. Oh, I might get Navas actually. Or Mendy. Mendy, man, Mendy was a beast last year. Let me see Mendy's form here now. Let me see. Mendy's a big unit too, man. He's 197. Let me see what stats he has. High. Oh, I don't like that high punt. That's enough now not to... No, I'm not getting him with a high punt. Let me see his Ter Stegen. Is he low punt? Yeah, I like I like this. Okay, Ter Stegen could be an option. He's only 20,000 more. Navas? Navas is a bit short, though. He has low punt and penalty saver. We see Mendy, Lloris, Jan Sommer, De Gea. Does De Gea have low punt? He should. Yeah. Man, I'm telling you, I'm looking at Ter Stegen here. What height is Ter Stegen? What? He's a bit too more too much, I think. Courtois, Neuer, Oblak. I think we're going to go Donna, lads. He's 196. Is he the tallest keeper? I think Oblak's bigger. No, he, or Neuer might be bigger. No, he's not. He's not. He's not. What am I saying? Courtois might be. Yeah, Courtois is a beast. Um, oh, man, that's a tough choice. That is a tough choice. Courtois. Let me see what his out wide is. 59. Donnarumma. 68. Okay, that settles it, lads. We're going to sign him. We're going to sign Donna. We're going to get our team sorted here. Go on, Donna. Come into the squad, my lad. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Munain, right? Oh, 34. <sighs> Lads, 34,000. Man, Munain. He's one of my favorite players. He's A rating as well. Like, this is a, this is a no brainer for me, right? One of the best players I've ever had in a Pez game. Him and Pedro, it's a mix-up between the two of those. But him being on A form, instant buy. Now, I know he's a left winger, and I need, a, a, like, a left midfielder. Um, but I'm happy to play him in, a, in an advanced role. And I'm going to show you what I do with my team in a minute when I get it set up. Because I am going to be doing the offline cup, and then we'll play one or two online as well. To see what the game is playing like. See what the game looks like and be ready to rock and roll with that. So I'm going to just proceed with him. I need a right One midfielder as well. Gone, we're going way off, 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 uh, off kilter here now at the moment. Saka, Kondreva, Correa, Corona, Lucas Mora. Let me see Lucas Mora's speed now. Hmm, not bad. A little bit of pace out wide would be nice. Let me see what he looks like. Hmm, not bad, not bad. Corona's 34. Why is he so cheap? He's A form as well, man. This could be something that I get. Siri, stop listening to me. This could be something, this could be a good player to get. Form unwavering, injury resistance high. Right, so I'm going to be playing it. Look at all the positions he can play. Lads, this guy looks like an absolute monster. He's a he's offensive full back as well, so I could play him right back. Out wide, 64. Speed, 73. Trickery, dribbling. Man, this guy looks pretty tasty. I'm going to sign him. I don't know why, I just, I have, a, I have a good feeling about him. I have a good feeling about him. If we don't get on, he's gone, he's out the gap, but I just get certain feelings about certain players, and I just, I don't know much about this guy. I know, obviously, like, who he plays for and stuff, and I've seen a couple of clips of him, but I'm not going to let on like I'm some, um, 
some encyclopedia on uh, La Liga with all the players and stuff. But I do like the I do like the cut of him now. He looks very, very tasty. I'm down to a million, so I've spent a good bit, but I've got most of my players now. 51,000! Ah, uh, here. Uh, man, he should be about, like, 300,000 for me. Like, I think that they should be balancing that a little bit better. Now, I will say that I do like the fact that you can buy and sell the players instantly. Like, that adds to a load of different uh, options that you can do. Um... Like, there's just, oh, Militao, he's, nah, he's a little bit too, lads, it's looking like it's going to have to be, it's looking like it's going to have to be one of the big boys, isn't it? Koulibaly, let me see, it could be Varane, actually, Varane is actually quite decent in this, from what I remember, he's 180k, I mean, would I be crazy to buy Van Dyke? Like, I know I'd probably be set then for the whole... Like, but he's half my budget and I still need to buy players. And I'm going to concede goals anyway. Do you know what I mean? Like, I'm, it's not like I'm going to just not concede goals. Let me see what Van Dyke's speed is. If it's if it's decent, it's 70 left. I mean, like, I can't say no to Van Dyke, can I? I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for it. 490. Crazy. Half my budget gone. Oh, you better not let me down, Van Dyke, because I swear to God, you'll get a kick up the hood if you do. But I do trust Van Dijk, lads, especially beside Piaul. Piaul is, Piaul is very tigerish, but like I need somebody for the high balls and stuff. The Marco Nuno Mendes, lads, he wouldn't be a bad little option now. He would not be a bad option at all. Sixty-seven, yeah, straight in. I don't even need to mess around. I'm just, I know that Mendes would be good. Trust me on that. Now, the other big question I have is right. I have my team done now, as far as I'm aware. Let me just double check and get the team right, and then upgrade a couple of players as well. What I was thinking of doing, right, was playing the Kata as a as a CMF here, right? He goes up to 84 and then playing um, Romario as a SS or an AMF even and then Zaggy up front. Crazy? Am I crazy? I am probably crazy. I should probably keep like a... Like I have no bench. Like I need to get a little bit of a bench. I'm not going to play... I'm not going to play... Well, look, I'm going to play one game against offline because I've been recording for like 50 minutes and haven't played I don't yet. think there's going to be many higher level than me because... Oh, no, no, no. Come on now. I thought I was going to be setting it by myself. I'm definitely going to play in Legend and I'll probably get smacked. But we'll dive in at the deep end. Superstar, how much does that give you? 2.25. Let me see. 2.60. All right, look, we'll go, we'll go Superstar because I think... Are the matches 10 minutes? Are the matches 10 minutes? I'm not too sure. Have you can receive bonus five new players from your following team? Okay, so we've got Chelsea. We've got... Oh, yeah, we should have a lot of these bonus... Oh, yeah. I mean, pretty much all my team is going to be bonus level. That's grand. All right, so they're all going to get bonus level. So they are. I should think... Uh, lads, I think we do need to, get, we need to buy a sub, but let's see what happens. No, do you know what? Look, I want to play top player. No, 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 I'm not playing. <sighs> oh, shit, I went out. Go back in. Because I need to practice anyway. If I get whooped, I get whooped. But I want to see what happens if I do win or do lose. I want to see what kind of the rewards are like. So you need 250 points for that and then 3,000 till the main reward, which is 5,000 GP. Um, so let's see who I'm going to be playing against. Is it a mixture? This could be a disaster. So if I do start getting hammered, I'm going to probably rage quit. Oh, Munayin looks quite good. Donnarumma. I like these little cutscenes, lads. We've seen a lot of these in the pre-match stuff. Um, but yeah, we definitely need an option file. Like edit mode needs to come soon. Get it out quick. Lads, this is, I'm enjoying this. I must say, this is very, very, very enjoyable. Inzaghi through the gap. Inzaghi through the gap. A little touch. And again... Oh, Nakata, Munayin. Oh, that'll do, that'll do. Now, Romario, cover the shift. I'm covering with Munayin. Oh, that's lovely. That's better. I love that teammate press when you do it that way. Paddy V. Vieira. The cross. Corona! He's done it, I told you! I told you, lads. Corona. What did I say? I can pick him. I can... F oh, I can pick him, boy. Jesus, I'm some scout. I'm wasted. I'm a scout. I just picked him. I just saw him. I was like, yeah, I'm going to buy him. He's 50k. He's probably the cheapest player I have in the team. And I just trusted him to finish that. I knew it was in the minute he let it go. He doesn't even have a proper face. And he just put it in. Let me see. Am I going to press now here? I don't want to get too carried away. Oh, go back, Piaul. 
What a save, Donnarumma. That's why he's in. That's why he's getting the big bucks. That's a beautiful save. I just I just slipped up a little bit there with the with Piaul. I took the switch off him and then it was too late. But that's a fantastic one-handed save from Donna. That's what I that's why I'm paying him the big bucks, lads. That's what you expect from him. Who wants it? Who wants to be the hero? Vieira. Nakata. Little tricks and flicks from Nakata. Romario, see he's he's wasted there. He's not really an attack him and feeler type of player. First time. Beautiful. Paddy V. Keep the run on now, Nuno Mendes. Give me an option. Give me an option. I said, give me an option. There we go. Monain. Oh, lads, this is this is magical. This, oh, that would have been a goal. Yeah, baby, is a Corona again. Lads, he's the man. I told you. I told you. I told you that he was, he wants a selfie with me now. I told you. I told you that he was the man. Oh, that's a fucking Wilson. I should be on some football team scouting list. I should. I should be headhunted. Monain, there's three. The wingers are doing it for me. My left and right midfielders. I told you, that's how I like to play. I like to cut inside. I like to pinch. And I like to get the possession in. Romario has been wasted from EMF. But that's just a terrible mistake from the AI. I like to see that. Little foot roll. Create the gap. 3-0. Bye-bye, Bilbao. It's too late for subs now, boss. It's too late for subs. Romario, sweat. 4-0. Too easy. And this team are just absolutely devastated. Nah. I mean, there's a lot of good players here. But I don't... Yeah, I don't want to spend... Like, I'm not going to buy Kevin De Bruyne. I can't afford him. Or Bruno. Silva. Mount. Gomez. Zielinski. Pellegrini. We say maybe like maybe 50, 60, maybe 70. Yeah, one of these boys maybe would be an option. Madison would be good, actually, in D form, though. Malinowski. Mm. Again, he's got very good stats. Very good stats. Christian Eriksen. Isco. Isco's actually a bit of a beast for me. You know what? I will buy Isco. I'm going to buy Isco, lads. And I'm also going to train up. Who am I going to train up? Right, this goes in. The, this goes in the team. What can I say, lads? I, I like this kid. I like this guy a lot. So we are. Now I know he can still be boosted up. It's no problem. But I just want to see what he what he kind of turns into. There's a lot of potential here for him. Like he's got really nice base base stat line here. He's got thirty right, so I can put him out wide for two. We we'll keep that, and then. Let me see. So if I was to just put him strictly pace, I could put him 90 pace. Probably don't need 90 though. 85 and 82. When does it stop taking him as 2? 15, 14, 13, 12. Okay. And then 18, 16, 20, 21. Okay. Put him at that and then dribbling. See, his finishing is poor, but he already banged in two beastly goals, so I don't really need to, need to upgrade that too much. Yeah, he's not going to be finishing really for me. Okay. That'll do. I mean, he looks good, man. He's going to be 80, 83, maybe. Okay, I think I'm happy with that. I'm going to leave the rest of the team and jump straight into an online match. All eyes on Corona. He's looking for a contract extension. Might get it, but a big performance here would be huge for him. It would be huge for him. Huge for his, his future too. Let's see. All right. Okay. All right. I'm black. I, I'm the, the, the blue kids this, this game. The black kids. Black and blue. Lovely press. All right, get back Van Dyke. That'll do. It's no problem for Mendes. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Here we go. Romario. Back heel. Lovely. Let's go. Let's go's first game. Little in intricate passing. Oh, I should have I should have cracked. What ang what camera angle is this, lads? Let me just check something. It's a different camera, no? I haven't gone mad. It is a different camera. Uh, let me see. Yeah, dynamic wide is where we're at. I like stadium now, don't get me wrong, but I'm used to dynamic wide from years and years of playing. It's go. Oh, he's just beautiful feet, hasn't he? There we go, money in. Give the option on money. Yeah. Give do it quick. Nakata! Yes. It's go. Ref! 
Oh my days. Please, please, please tell me how that's not a penal. Monain, overlap. Here we go. Good lad. I can't be missing those chances, lads. Not online. Not online. Like, you can't be missing those. I should have had a penalty. I'm a bit rattled about that now, I'll be honest with you. I think this guy's a bit rattled too. He knows he got away with it. It's just different class. It's lovely as well. Oh, I've got men streaming forward. Romario. Nakata. Oh, lovely tackle. Get back, Piaul. Oh, he's off, surely. He's not. Oh, that's a cracking finish. What a goal. I thought he was offside, to be honest with you, but that was a some finish. Unreal finish. Oh, he didn't even want to watch it. I was going to admire that goal. Instant replay. He just wants to get on with it. I, 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 I admire that. He's probably used to banging goals like that. But is he used to conceding goals? Oh my god, Munayin. Lads, I'm wasting my chances here. I should have just settled on that. I'm in it though, I'm ripping him like, I'm ripping him, I'm ripping him, I'm ripping him. I just have to keep telling myself that I'm a beast. And I'm better than him. Get off for it, Van Dyke. It's brilliant press. But I don't get the, I don't get it. Jesus, I'm getting no breaks, lads. Reese James. Turn back. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, this guy's a bit of a dirtbag now. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that little, like, stopping me on the break. Ooh. Like, just let me play a ball. Like, that's all I want to play. And I want to, I'm going to beat him now. See, when you anger me like that, I make it my business to punish rats. A rat catcher. And if I get one, he's going to crumble. I'm telling you that right now. Yeah, he's panicking. Look, what did I tell you? Just got lucky. That's okay. We'll take that. I'd rather, I'd rather be good than lucky. See? Money. Back heel. Oh my days, if I score this. Oh my. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> oh man, he's just mesmerized. He's letting me watch it a court. No, he's not. He's... I would have let you watch yours. You skipped yours, not me. Go on, true ball it. You're not going to get past Munayin. First line of defense. Romario, over the gap. Go on, Romario. We'll take it. We'll take it. He's at sixes and sevens, lads. Well done, Van Dyke. Good lad. Lovely, Nakata. Fantastic play. Money, beautiful. Romario, the runner. Munayin, beautiful ball. Boom, baby. He's not used to this assortment of talent on, this, on, the, on the pitch of these 11 players. He's confused as why I'm not using somebody like, you know, Bruno Fernandes as an attacking midfielder, or why I'm using Corona right, right. One second now, lads. This could be a banger. Reese James. Mm, testing the keepers. Ter Stegen's in goals. He's not looking too happy with that one. I nearly broke his two fingers. Romario, take out. Go the inside gap. He won't be expecting it. He won't be expecting it. He won't be expecting that because I wasn't expecting that. I didn't know what I was doing, but. <sighs> Man. Nice little play now. Probably need to break it up. Good save. Ooh. I was getting lucky there now. But to be honest with you, I was backing off a little bit with Vieira and I probably should have tried to close him down a little bit. Corona. Oh, Corona. The dancing feet of Corona. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, Corona. Oh, man. This guy is a magician. Oh, Corona. Oh, my days. He's so good, man. He's so good. I love him. I just love players that you find like that. You just get, they just catch your eye. He's going to get it back now. He's looking for it again. Oh, Beckenbauer doesn't want to know about it. Oh, ref. There we go. Corona. Silly challenge. I'm going to have to pop this in now. But lads, I'm telling you, this guy Corona, keep an eye on him. Keep an eye on him. And he'd be one. No, actually, don't buy him because I want him to be my secret little man. Mario. Oh, this could be too high. This would definitely seal the deal. 
if it bangs into top corner. It's the pressure's on, lads, but you have to be able to take the pressure, you know? I just think this guy is like, with the runs of my players going forward, he's like looking around, he doesn't know where, he doesn't know where the next pass is going to come from. It's not me, it really. It's kind of the players, the AI. I'm not doing much. I'm just kind of waiting. I'm not pushing anything. I'm just playing it kind of slow. Yeah, you can try sweat it through the middle, but it's not going to work. Now, admittedly, he does have a worse team than me. Like, I'm not going to say, like, I've masterminded some, like, tactical masterpiece here. He does have a worse team than me. Because the game feels a little bit less responsive for me in the last 10 minutes. But we'll take that. That better not be a peno now. What? He's going to go middle because I think he knows he's not going to win. Oh, what a goal. Jeez, that's some pen. I wouldn't have saved that anyway. I can't see a pen there, though, lads. That's, that's a worry. The collision system like that, that's, that's something I'm going to have to keep my eye on. Don't like that at all. Oh, lovely Vieira. Lovely play, lads. Oh, fucking beautiful. Oh, lads, this, that's just... <laughs> yeah, he's just panicking a little bit. He's just pan... Oh, Vieira, boy! Look what it means to Vieira, lads. First victory for a big lads FC. He's absolutely buzzing. Jesus, God help the wife tonight. Ha! Huh? Jesus Christ, he's some stallion, man. Nuno Mendes is a bit more reserved, but that's a great yeah, video. Look, it's been, it's been emotional. It's been a hell, of a, a hell of a video. It's my longest video I've ever recorded, so I don't know whether I'll upload the whole thing or whether I'll split it in. I hope the audio is okay. There was a couple of weird things going on there with the audio, but um, yeah, let me know if you enjoyed it. Let me know if you like these kind of long extended playthroughs that you can see. Um, and let me know if you'd like streams. That's basically where this is, end, where this is going. So yeah, we're going to end it there. And don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. Don't forget to keep an eye on our Twitters as well and uh, we'll be updating you with some stuff. But until next time, lads, peace. Adios.